Good evening. I'm Takia Smith in for Donna Bush with your CIG television news brief on this Wednesday, the 24th of January. This morning, Her Excellency the Governor, Mrs. Jane Owen, Premier Honorable Juliana O'Connor Connolly, Deputy Premier Honorable Andre Ebanks, and Minister for Planning, Agriculture, Housing and Infrastructure, Honorable J. Ebanks, signed the National Road Safety Pledge. They demonstrated their support for the National Road Safety Strategy and were given commemorative pins that proudly display the slogan for the government's road safety campaign, No More for 2024. The public is encouraged to sign the Safe Drivers Pledge by visiting www.gov.ky forward slash road safety forward slash pledge. Attendees of the Chamber of Commerce Economic Forum next month will also be able to take the pledge and receive their pin. Speaking of the Chamber of Commerce Economic Forum, this year's forum is scheduled for Friday the 2nd of February and will be under the theme of creating a sustainable economy. The event will feature presentations from top government leaders, including the Governor Mrs. Jane Owen, the Honorable Premier Juliana O'Connor Connolly, the Deputy Premier Honorable Andre Ebanks, and Minister for Tourism and Ports Mr. Kenneth Bryan, along with other private sector leaders. The forum will offer a comprehensive look at the events that are shaping Cayman's economy now and into the future. Now let's take a look at our forecast for tonight and tomorrow. Tonight we can expect partly cloudy skies with a 20% chance of rain. Temperatures will fall to the mid 70s Fahrenheit. Winds will be easterly at 15 to 20 knots. Seas will be rough with wave heights of four to six feet, especially along the south and east coast. Small crafts should exercise caution. The outlook is for a continued decrease in winds and sea conditions through Thursday evening as a high pressure system drifts east over the central Atlantic Ocean. Remember, to get the latest on local weather, you can visit weather.gov.ky and also check out the National Weather Service's Facebook page. And that ends today's news brief here on CIG Television. To our YouTube viewers, don't forget to like, share and subscribe for all your key government updates. I'm Takiya Smith in for Donna Bush. Have a wonderful evening and we'll see you again tomorrow.